Hi, I'm Bob Lutzinski, President of First Resort Safety. As you can see, the title of this video is Carbon Monoxide Poisoning. And I'm going to run a little experiment here, testing the performance of the CO Experts Model 2016 low-level CO Health Monitor. All I'm going to do is light a candle and trap carbon monoxide coming from this candle in a little glass container. I'll trap CO in here for about one minute. So let me tell you about your home CO alarm. Your home CO alarm is a life-saving device, don't get me wrong, but it's not a health monitor. The sad fact of the matter is tens of millions of people, pregnant women, the children they're carrying, newborn infants, children in general, people with respiratory illnesses like asthma and COPD, people with heart problems, and the elderly are all affected by low-level exposure, especially chronic low-level exposure to carbon monoxide. This type of exposure is experienced especially in the wintertime when we spend more and more of our time in, inside in our own homes. So now that I've trapped some carbon monoxide in this container, we're going to put a stopwatch next to the monitor and see how long it takes to detect it. Let me just adjust everything here. And I have a little fogging on the device. Let me move this back. And hopefully I can clear this picture up for us to see. So you can see the clock has been running for about 40 seconds. The first alarm set point on the home CO alarm is at 70 parts per million. You're going to see an immediate display at 7 parts per million. And your first alarm reading is going to uh, show, like I said, at 7 parts per million. And your first alarm is going to be heard at 10 parts per million. So you'll hear the beep. And we'll let this little experiment run for about another 30 seconds. The point of having this device in your home is to supplement or fill in the gap for the device that you currently have. The device you have in your home by law needs to be there. This device is going to give you the low level health benefits of knowing that you have carbon monoxide in your home way, way, way before and possibly even ever before your device will go off. So many times people tell me that they've never heard their CO alarm go off and what I'm showing here is proving just that. The numbers that you see in this video, 10 parts per million, 12 parts per million, are not going to trigger an alarm for your home CO alarm. So we're at about three and a half minutes, three minutes and 45 seconds, and we have values up to almost 20 parts per million, 25 parts per million, and the length of the video is four minutes, but the device has only been detecting carbon monoxide for just over two minutes. Thanks for watching my video. My name is Bob Ludzinski. I'm the president of First Resort Safety. You can visit our website, www.firstresortsafety.com, to purchase this device, to schedule carbon monoxide awareness training classes. And remember, First Resort Safety, we're here because education plus detection equals protection. Be aware and be safe. Take care.